In my first video, I've already explained why there is no such thing as an all-purpose glue. And since you need a different adhesive for nearly every bonding issue, there are countless types of adhesives available. So, how do you know which one to go for? Patrick, how do I find my perfect match? Before we get to that question, let's look at the advantages of adhesive bonding in general. Adhesive bonding allows joining of all different kinds of materials, whether it's wood, plastic, glass, ceramic, and many others. Adhesives are very light in comparison to screws or traditional fixing elements. So basically, the less weight, the less to carry. With adhesive bonding, you do not change or deform the material surface, as opposed to the thermal stresses caused, for example, through welding. Using adhesives is often a big benefit for visual and cosmetic reasons. Especially transparent adhesives allow nearly invisible connections. With adhesive bonding, you can achieve a much more even transfer of forces. Rivets or screws, for example, cause a point load. An additional benefit of some adhesives is their cushioning and sealing abilities. Adhesives are easy to dispense and can be applied extremely precisely. Sometimes you only need a few drops to achieve an enormously strong bond. Adhesive bonding can be done pretty much anywhere at any time. You don't need expensive machinery or any special tools. Especially in terms of sustainability, adhesives are of great benefit. They enable you to repair things instead of throwing them out. And the best thing, thanks to low material consumption, quick solutions and the sustainability aspects, you save time and money. Choosing the right adhesive is a lot like choosing in love. It just has to fit very well. But what exactly has to fit? With adhesives, this one's easier to figure out than with love. You just have to ask yourself a couple of questions. What materials are going to be bonded? What size of bonding surface or bonding gap do you have? Depending on the material and the structure of the bonding components, you either need a runny, viscous or a pasty adhesive. This specific property of a liquid is what a chemist calls viscosity. Viscous adhesives are able to penetrate larger surface cracks. Smaller ones, however, not so much. Very thin adhesives penetrate nearly every small crack, yet they can be too runny for larger indentations or more absorbent surfaces, such as wood. In addition, you should always consider how much time you have for the bonding process. There are certain adhesives which take seconds or minutes to cure. Others, hours or even days. What's also important, what loads does the joint have to carry after adhesive bonding? In other words, you can ask, what's it used for? Simple example, do you want to drink out of the glued cup or do you just want to use it as a pen holder? Which environmental conditions is the adhesive joint exposed to? Which temperatures prevail? And what other forces affect the materials? So many questions. In case you've lost track, please feel free to leave your questions in the comment section below, and I'll be happy to get back to you when I can. If you're getting impatient or you need some immediate help, then please feel free to use our adhesive finder. And then maybe you too can find your perfect match. Wow, that's nice. Thanks, and stick at it.